How about Mahesh? Hey, Mahesh. What is the best way to do? What is the best way to do to download streaming videos? Is it possible mm -hmm. that in some websites you can only view but not download that streaming video? It's possible in that um, they could have measures in place to try to protect their intellectual rights, for sure. And if that's the case, then then I can't obviously suggest a way to to breach copyright or anything like that. But if you're using Flash, and, and unfortunately I don't have information here, but I remember Mahesh saying, uh, I believe they were on Ubuntu, right? So if you're on Linux, when, you, when you're looking at a Flash website, that Flash file, as it downloads, like say, say you're on YouTube, for example, right? As it downloads, you see that red progress, progress bar uh, growing before the rest of the, the video is actually played, right? Mm. You've seen that, so you know that it's downloaded all of the video even though you're only a third of the way through watching it. Right. So where does it save that to? It saves it to your internet, your, well, your computer's temp folder. So if you jump into Places and Home, that's going to bring up your Notilus window, your, your browser basically for your file system, and then just jump over to slash TMP. That's your temp folder on Linux. So you'll see in there you've got whatever Flash video has downloaded. Once it's already downloaded, you've got the full Flash video in there. You'll have some random name, and it doesn't have a file extension. If you keep it on your Linux box and just copy it somewhere, then you've got it, and it will work. If you're going to transfer it onto another system, you'll probably need to rename it to an appropriate format, uh, like you know, video.flv, for example, something along those lines. But give that a try if it's a Flash site and if you're on Linux. If you're on another platform, there are websites that help you do that. But you want to make sure, again, that you're not violating anyone's intellectual rights. Um, and in a case like... I think, for the most part, if if you have the right to download the video, they're they're going to provide a way for you to get it. Like for example, Category Five, we're licensed under uh, under Creative Commons attribution, and so you can you can actually download the the video off our website. In fact, we've added to the wiki. You can now download the master video, so the full quality video. Uh, you can even download that, and you can do whatever you want with it because it's licensed that way. But um, if you're having to find ways to circumvent uh, people's sites, then it's most likely that you don't have the right to do that. So just be conscious of that. That's all I would ask.